guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another video to another vlog if you're new here hi my name is sharon we do last our vlogs mostly and i hope you're going to like it here and you do decide to subscribe uh by clicking the subscribe button down below and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back to watch this video you guys so today what day is it today today is um tuesday and i just decided to start vlogging because i feel like vlogging for me has become such a habit i just like to document things like i'm busy taking videos of everything i don't know if it's a healthy habit or whatever it is but anyway welcome to another vlog i don't know what we're going to be doing like in regards to this entire vlog but as for today i am going to have a meeting in avondal this is my mom's errand that i'm doing so we're gonna have a meeting on behalf of my mom and then probably just come back home because i don't have any plans for the day oh well besides shooting uh some content for my business page that's all that i have planned what else nothing nothing more so yeah let's just get into this vlog from here we're going straight to the meeting that i have i'm with wendy by the way so yeah i hope you guys are going to enjoy this vlog <laughs> Our meeting went really great. This. Oh, not really. Manzozo at our name. And in some person vlog because I'm not so fun what antiquated time. Anyway, someone suggested that I come to this. Uh, it's a farmer's market, and we've been meaning to come here. It's in what's what's what area is this? Newton Park. Hey. Yes. So that's why we are here. We're just going to check it out. In the Tushaganya Machai so hopefully i can also get it let me show you the signage really. so this is the sign this is what it looks like and then you just walk towards that hill i'm just going to take this one Oof. hi guys you know sometimes why do my days start very calm very okay and then all of a sudden it's now three o'clock and i'm busy running around harare like a headless chicken but anyway let me update you guys so i came to the veggie place that i showed you guys earlier and i was going to use eco cash usd right and they say it's their eco cash or whatever their swipe whatever they want cash because the other systems were not working and i didn't have cash on me so i was like it's fine i'll buy the thing some other time but short and short i really needed the greens so i just decided that you know what i was with wendy then we just decided to go home we went to our house and then he had breakfast while we were having breakfast wendy decided that she needed to come here again to get a few things and i was like okay it's fine so i can get some cash and then come back so that's why we are back here she's still getting some help and uh from here i think we're gonna go home i'm so tired i think we'll do a haul when i get home of everything that i bought if i'm going to give you an honest review i think this is a much cheaper place than a uh, mass job but not cheap as buying in park street so if you don't like i understand from the street and whatnot you know it's we, we all prefer different things that's fine so if you like you know that this level of convenience i think this place i would uh, recommend but if you also like mass job just because of the air because this is a closed area and it's more limited to just you know farmers market produce whereas mass job you have um what do you call it you know food clothes um flowers oh and i also got flowers i'll show you guys when i get home so now we're go actually going to get to master because i need some when you need some fresh cream and i think i'm also going to get some fresh cream because i want to make a potato bake for supper tonight Woo, adulting when i tell you adulting hmm? how do you feel because the client 
Because they recline. They recline, but anyway, I feel like it was fee. It yeah, was very much fee. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'll catch you guys on our way to Masto. I have to do that minimum stage. Chai, chai. I have to do all the time. I have to do all the time. I have to do all the time. Moment of truth. Good evening guys when i tell you <laughs> the day we've had so i think i last spoke to you guys when we were I, I filmed a little bit when we were at um the fresh cream shop and then after that we were coming back i think we were uh, going to what do you call it where were we going anyway i can't even remember as we were about to turn into this road, we hit this uh, metal thing. Apparently, there's a wire inside. So, tire, let us say, got sweeped a little bit and then the tire got destroyed. That meant having that tire puncher, we, we needed a spare tire. We didn't have a spare tire, so we had to wait for someone who could come and help us. He came, then after taking the tire out, discovered that it was completely damaged. So, we need a new tire. Then, Tino came, we chilled with Tino for a bit. After that, I think Max and TK arrived around the same time and then we had to leave. So when you got another car, um, then, then we, she drove me home, dropped me off. Now she's on her way home. Max is going to get the tire while Tinda kind guns the car. Yeah, she had this quite high. Hey guys, it was a quite a team effort, but yeah, I'm just, I just feel sorry for Wendy because yeah. It's been quite a week, but anyway, guys, don't want the adulting. So we went to the market. I just want to show you the things that I got. I spent $11 on everything I'm going to show you guys, which I think was fair because I know if it was the master of market, I would have spent about $20, $25 on this. So first, we got a head of lettuce. There's a pot on the stove, so it's going to make a little bit of moist. Got a cucumber for our salads and also just for snacking for the kids. That was a dollar. The lettuce was, I'm not sure. I'm not sure my price and just there. And then got this cabbage for our costlows. We used to use cabbage to cook salsa, but these days my garden is flourishing, so we don't need cabbage for salsa anymore. And then got a kg of butternuts. And then also got a packet of carrots for, um, how do you call it? A um, coleslaw. And then a um, mushroom. Mushroom, I remember it was going for was it two ninety? I'm not sure. I can't remember anymore. Also got some. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Also got some green peppers. And then what else is in here? Okay. Also got some onions. I know these were dollar eighty, and I think that's a fair price. Um. Then also got um. What is this? Green beans. Then also got quite a number of bananas, but people in this house, I always say it, bananas don't last in this house. It's almost like we have to buy bananas every single day. And then lastly, I got myself some flowers because I haven't had flowers in a while. And these were only $5. So yeah, I'm pretty excited about this. I think from now on, I think I'm going to go there quite, just to get the vibe, but I think I like it. I also like their prices. So for now, I'm just going to get myself um, busy because I need to start me pre preparing supper before Max gets back from fixing the time.
Also, keep in mind, we don't know how to sing a tune for Ziega. So, can you marry your cousin? I'm not my cousin. Don't you understand? You know what we don't know about this one. I don't know the difference, but okay. Say something. Oh, I know, but I need to know where the problem is with me buying myself flowers because you know I like flowers. Even there, it's a zoo where we find cheap flowers. Tap a change, tap a change. Welcome back to another day in the vlog. Today is actually Independence Day. It's the 18th of April. And if you're not Zimbabwean, this is the day that we celebrate um, our independence. So um, it's actually a public holiday. Yesterday was a Wednesday. I didn't vlog because I was just too busy. I tried to vlog, but it was just not making sense. So because today is a holiday, uh, I need to go into town to get a new carpet. Why? <laughs> so... The old setup that we had in our like our sitting area i'm sure you guys saw that um ezra used to like to climb and sit at the back of the tv how he started doing that how he i don't even know like i, I personally i don't understand how kids brains work but basically it was his favorite place to sit at some point i felt like the tv would have fallen and yeah yeah click so we decided that we needed to change our setup so we had the tv hung i'm gonna put a cutaway on top of this video tv however because of the position of our sofa it's a five seater l shape we don't have enough space to accommodate this new setup so we had to take out the other part of the sofa to make sure that we have enough leg room plus 
enough room for the table so we're going to need two armchairs i don't know we will figure it out i've realized that with this house a lot of these updates that we make it has taken us a long time i think because at some point i didn't like this place i felt like we were going to move but when you look at harare rentals <laughs> They will humble you so quickly. You will say, oh, <laughs> let me go back to my house. So I see us moving out of this place eventually when we are moving to a place of our own by God's grace. So um, right now, I'm off to town to get a carpet because we need, um, it's just feeling a little bit empty. Uh, so that's where we are heading to. I'm going to go to Carlos somewhere because that's where I usually buy my cup. It's the gray one. That's where I got it from. So yeah, let's go. I am wearing this top. Where is this? Oh, Rutenda gifted me this top on my birthday. And then these pants you guys have seen, uh, they are from Foshini, Big Mr. Price, Shoes Mr. Price, and Lovisa with earrings. So my husband is actually waiting for me. Let's go. to cut us home way and then i got the carpet i got uh some new dinner plates and then i got a few things so we're just going to do a little bit of a haul however before we get into the wall i don't think i'll be showing you guys the carpet because we just tried to put it uh in our sitting area and it's a very small carpet it's in the shop it didn't look very small i thought um, it was going to work with the space that we have, but it's clearly it's small. So we have to go back This cupboard is going for four to five dollars and then um, The one that I think I actually need to go and get is going for $75 so I need to go into pop $30. They did say that she can come in exchange if the size is small However, also the problem is the color that I wanted is on the smaller carpet. So it means I have to go to another branch uh, and try and see if I can get um, the colors that I want on a bigger carpet. If I can't, then I'll have to settle for, you know what, what's boring me about this whole thing? Okay, I have to settle for, <laughs> I have to settle for a different color. But the problem is, a few months back, I actually saw a very nice carpet um in this store you know kade and sons where i buy my where i bought um the gas stove um the air fryers they had they had really nice carpets but they sold out and the ones that they have now they're just trying to clear them out and before they can restock so i have nowhere else to get this carpet could it cheaper so that's why i have to go to carlos home way anyway we'll go back in the afternoon and then i'll show you how the lounge will be looking like and then after getting the carpet i like i said i got some dinner plates yo this was the last set of uh, this design in the shop so well it's five i wanted six sorry and the receipt is in here so uh, actually let me take them out of the solid tape so that i can show you guys properly i just need to cut out the pillow tip because they use the tape to hold the place together so that they won't crack or break so yeah i'm not going to lift all of this place i'm just going to show you one so clearly they need a wash but basically this is how they look a dishwasher safe a microwave safe Sometimes I like to put my plates in the oven. Like if I cook something that is cheese on top, I want to put it in the oven. So I'll also check, but I think they should be fine. Uh, the other time, the guy used plate in the oven and in Shibuza, she kept with the plate broke. So I try to be careful when it comes to that. So these plates were going for $2 each. They have the whole range of these plates. All I want to say is, these plates are nice. You're going to find a wide range of plates and white and gray and black white and gold it's just a mixture of different patterns so i got five of those 
that was ten dollars and then where's the receipt okay i want to show you guys the receipt so the carpet was 45. how many plates do i have yet well i'm just gonna i try have six more plates and in in the total five what so I, I okay this is the reason enough for me to actually go back because there was also a mistake i got six because i got i got five because i got appeared but he and charge just six plates so i need to go back for that two dollars guys two dollars is a lot of money oh i will go back when i go back with the carpet and then i also request that they give me another plate then on the side of the road on our way back pockets of oranges i think winter time here in zimbabwe is when you get uh, affordable oranges so this whole pocket is going for five dollars and then also got a pocket of potatoes was also going for five dollars this is enough a pocket a five kg pocket is enough to last us i think maybe two weeks tops so this should be fine to take us through to month end then also got as usual some more bananas because we've run out but anyway right now my husband um has gone out for a little bit when he gets back we will have to go back to town and then i'll show you guys um Phew, i'm exhausted i'll show you guys how the place will be looking like right now i just want to have my eggs bread and tea so yeah just a few that. moments later <laughs> So, um, we went to town. We wanted to exchange the carpet that I had. We found a better one at the um, Herbert Chitepo branch. And I think it looks better. I'm not mad at it. I think I just need, you know, when something is new, you need to get used to it. So, the one that we got, like I mentioned, I needed to top up $30. So, we did that. And then I went to the town branch again because I wanted to go and get either my $2 or uh, another place so obviously like i had mentioned earlier the set that i bought earlier the ones that i bought the five places that i bought earlier were the last ones so i ended up getting a completely different design slightly it's still gray but when you look at them they're slightly different so i just took another plate because they said they don't do cash refunds even though that was a mistake on their part but i think it's still fine because what i don't want is when i make a mistake at the store guys i can't sleep i need to go back the same day so i'm just glad that we managed to do that um the place is looking okay um 
I'm still not sure to be honest, but we'll see. And the other thing is when you have kids, a lot of the things that you want to use for decor right now at the age that my kids are, it's just going to be pointless because they're going to play with it. Like my diffuser is a port. He, he took the entire sticks out, poured the whole liquid from the diffuser into the candle that was next to the diffuser. And I couldn't pour that whole liquid back into the candle. It was a whole mess. So even with that, it's like on the top of the table, but you can't even ask me how we got on top of the dining table. But yeah, that's life. And honestly, if you ask me, I wouldn't have it any other way. It is what it is. So that has been our day today. And for now, I think I'm just going to... I'm not going to cook supper. I think my papa is going to cook supper while I start editing this vlog so that you guys receive this on time. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. These kids, they are probably fighting for something. Ah, guys. Anyway, um, also, I have had a few people that have been coming from this channel to just come and buy dresses and to just support my small little business. I wanted to say shout out to you guys. Thank you so much, um, you know, for supporting your girl. I appreciate that. I actually had um, another delivery that I wanted to do uh, right now, but I'm torn up, so that was done. And I'm actually very grateful for that. So thank you, guys. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Make sure that you're subscribed. Make sure that you click the share button, the like button. And uh, most importantly, uh, if you watched up until this point, um, thank you so much. I'll see you guys.